students good morning to all you today we are going to learn the fusions second standard semester 2 books we have started the english first lesson unit 1 for lesson number 1 jatin's shoes name of lesson jatin's shoes starting the lesson look at the this both of picture here is the two picture they are showing before starting the lesson here two picture showing and in this two picture is different different things they are showing here in first picture here is a three children they are doing something and here is a one boy and he also doing something in this first picture see pencils were lying on the ground cap also same box also lie, lying on the ground the boy sitting to near front of box and one the child is sitting on the pillow and he watching the mobile and one is boy he is a taking the one plate and see his room condition it is a good no it is a very bad condition because all thing lying here and there yes na yes and this another picture here is a one boy he keeping his things all very carefully in his one box see he keep a ball in the box yes na yes this is a good manners and good thing and this is a very bad thing in this first picture we say the this all picture is very careless picture and this is a very carefully child picture yes na yes now we have start the lesson okay Zatin was a careless boy. He climbed trees and tore his clothes. He jumped on the steps and his shoes tore. He chewed the ends of the his pencils. He drew he drew the doodles in his books. Zatin's parents were angry with him because he was he was careless you know what is the meaning of careless yes students the careless meaning is not thinking enough about what are you doing so you are getting the mistakes again and again okay jatin was careful only about his kites he loved flying the kites in and to great a care of them he loves to his only kite no anything so he take care of only his kites okay one day jatin's father got him a new pair of shoes and told him if you tear if you tear these the shoes i will not buy you another pair today jatin's father brought to him a new pair of shoes and told him if you tear if you tear this the shoes i will not buy you another pair but jatin did not take care of his new shoes he jumped he ran he climbed he hopped uh, soon his shoes started to rip rip the jatin's mother told him go to a cobbler you know what is the meaning of cob who is a cobbler Yes, cobbler is a who making and repair a shoes, chappals, yes, sandals. Very good. But Jatin did not listen to his mother. One day, when Jatin was flying his kite, it got stuck in a tree. He climbed up the tree to get it out. Suddenly, he heard a sound. Rip! The tear in his shoes and had became a bigger. I don't care thought Jati he held his kite and jumped down but he did not land on the ground instead he found himself flying across the sky
sky in an unknown land. After a long time, Jatin landed to uh, landed on the ground. He had reached a strange place. He saw a board, cobbler land. Many cobblers were sitting around the when they saw when they saw a Jatin, they came to him. What cobbler said? I hear that you are a naughty. See what you what you have done to your shoes. They are almost dead. Miss, his shoes were uh, were a uh, totally dead toy, and also he not care about his shoes. He only care about his a uh, kite. So that cobbler says, "See your, they are your shoes uh, are almost dead." Jatin is a very careless boy, so. He didn't care about his shoes. Jatin was that time angry. Shoes don't have life, he said. He immediately said that what it shoes have don't have any life. Yes, they do. Don't you uh, hear them the squeak in the pain when you jump and hop? The cobbler asked. When when you are jump and you are Quack, that time whatever going to pants for shoes that jatin is not listen so that cobbler say ki you are not understanding about he that shoes pants who are you he asked the cobbler he asked the cobbler who are you we take care of the shoes that belongs to naughty children like you the cobbler say that cobbler said we take care of shoes that are belong to naughty children like you the cobbler said he handed the jatin a needle and thread and said start mending mending your shoes start to mending your shoes jatin got scared i don't mend shoes cobbler do that he said he immediately said i am not doing this this work This is work of cobblers. The cobbler said, "This is a our land. You have to do what we say. Start the mending the shoes." Jati started crying. "I am hungry," he said. That time he making a something like a telling a lie. So he asked him, "I am hungry." The cobbler gave him a pencil. Eat this pencil," he said. "What he said? Eat this pencil. We are eating the pencils, no, no, no." The cobbler gave him a pencil. "Eat this pencil," he said. All the all the cobblers laughed at the thin and went back to their work. That time, that all the cobblers started to laughing. The thin skyed was watching all this. Suddenly, it is it whispered to him, "You have to take good care of a uh, care of me. I will help you. Hold on to my tail, quick." What the kite said? Hold my tail to immediately quick because he want to help him. Jatin held on to the tail. The kite took him up with a swish. Hearing the noise, the cobblers came running, but Jatin and his kite had flown away. The kite brought a Jatin down near his house. Jatin said, "Thank you, thanks, kite." The kite said, "You have to be careful with your things. If you fly away again, even I can't help you." Of course, kite, I will take care of my things," he said. from that that day careless jatin became a careful jatin it is a very nice story na yes you also take care of your things your books your pen your pencils that all things whatever that you use and also in our house that we have keep we have take a care of all of things okay this is a story written by a sukumar rai who name of sukumar rai yes do you like to this story yes very good
बोलू थैंक यू